Number is one of the oldest Igbo organizations in the United States, and Wanted the Number also is one of the formidable affiliates of the World Igbo Congress. Wanted the Number members, the House of Assembly, the Board of Directors, and the Executive Cabinet have unanimously endorsed one of their own to run for the chairmanship of the World Book Congress. Looking at the present candidates, we believe that we have picked a better choice. And while I do ask of you, my brothers and sisters, my fellow affiliates of the World Book Congress, my fellow board members, and members of the House of Delegates, we request that you honestly consider, evaluate, and ultimately vote for our candidate. Who is this candidate? This candidate is none but the only and only one, an astute businessman, a respectable man. A family man, a man of high honor and integrity, the one and only Chief Larry Madabuchuku Udodge, the Eze Wamato of the year. Thank you for listening to me. I am Chief Larry Madawishuku Odaji. I am here this evening to inform you personally that I've decided to run for the office of the Chairmanship of World Ibo Congress in the forthcoming election in Toronto, Canada. September 3, 2011. This decision was not reached lightly, but with great humility and introspection of what roles World Ibu Congress can play in shaping public discourse and development of our labor. With all the rancors and divisions World Ibu Congress has gone through these past years, we need a strong, hard-working leader who is straightforward, trustworthy, and respectful of divergent opinions, and dependable to pilot the World Ibo Congress ship of state. I believe that I'm the most qualified candidate to get this job done, willing and prepared to lead World Ibo Congress at this time, to bring about the unity and peace we need among our people. When elected chairman of World Ibo Congress, my administration will immediately seek to make World Ibo Congress relevant again by the introduction of a value-based leadership that is human-oriented, team-oriented, project-driven, and sensitive to the needs of all the affiliates of World Ibo Congress. Being sensitive and transparent at all times. I intend to lead World Ibo Congress to reunification and recapture its glory. I intend to appoint to my administration visionary and truthful individuals who at all times will promote dynamic actions and the, at the real issues affecting us as a people. Under my administration, 
One in the Congress will strive to implement progressive changes to enhance the status, recognition, and treatment of our women and children. So help me God. Thank you. Long live Warimo Congress. Long live Alibo. Long live Federal Republic of Nigeria. Oh, yeah.